Join me as I solve this puzzle-like mathematics expression. We are asked to solve for a, b, x, and y. Now, from this expression, you can see that a multiplied by b is equal to 21. x minus y is equal to 5. A plus x is equal to 8, and B multiplied by y is equal to 9. So we can get four different mathematical expressions from this puzzle like maths problem. Now let's get started. To solve this, we are going to bring out the four expressions. The first expression we'll have is A multiplied by B. A multiplied by B is equal to 21 right that will take that will be equation one we are also going to see that a x minus y x minus y is equal to five we'll take this as expression two and we will see that x l a plus x is equal to eight we'll have a plus x is equal to 8. We'll take this as equation 3, right? And then we'll see that b multiplied by y, which is by, is equal to 9. We'll take this as expression 4. So we're going to simplify this expression to find the value of a, b, x, and y. So from here, we are going to first consider the subtraction of equation 3 from equation 2 and we are going to subtract equation 3 minus equation 2 and we'll subtract equation 3 from equation 2 we're going to have a plus x minus x minus y and this will be equal to 8 minus 5, which is the result of those two expressions. Now, if we simplify this, what will our solution be? We're going to have this to become a plus x, negative times minus plus 1, uh, x is going to give us negative x, right? Minus times minus give us negative y, and this will be equal to 8 minus 3 will give us what? 8 minus 5 will give us 3. So what do we have here? This is going to clear up this, and then we'll have our a plus y to be equal to 3. I'm going to consider this as equation asterisk. Now, having gotten the equation asterisk, I'm going to consider other equations, expressions which we have derived. Now, let's consider expression 1, which is a multiplied by b equal to 21. If we look at a multiplied by b equal to 21, let's consider equation 1. From equation 1, let's consider a multiplied by b equal to 21. Since we have a required here, we're going to make a the subject of formula. If we divide here by b and divide here by b, then b will have to clear b, uh, a will be equal to 21 divided by b. Now, if we get 21 divided by b as our a, let's go to uh, equation 4. From equation 4, we are still going to find the value of uh, y. Let's look at making from equation 4, Let's consider equation 4 this time around. If we consider equation 4 this time around, we are, have from equation 4, b multiplied by y is equal to 9. Now let's make y the subject of formula. If we make y the subject of formula, y will be equal to 9 divided by b. Now from this expression, you come to see that we have a plus y equal to 3. So from that expression, if we insert the value of a and y, which is equal to 21 divided by b, and y equal to 9 divided by b respectively into that expression, 
we are going to have that expression to give us a plus y, we got it to be equal to 3. So our a is equal to a is equal to 21 divided by b, and our y is equal to 9 divided by b, and this would be equal to 3. That is from equation asterisk. Now, if we simplify this expression, we can simply have the value of b. Simplifying this, we have a common term, which is b. b divided by b is going to give us 1. 1 times 21 will give us 21 plus. b divided by b is going to give us 1. 1 times 9 is going to give us 9. And this will be equal to 3. If we cross multiply, we are going to have 3 multiplying b to be equal to 21 plus 9 is going to be 30. So from here, we can get the value of b. If we divide both sides by 3, divide here by 3, then 3 will have to clear 3, then our b will be equal to 10. 30 divided by 3 is 10. Now, having gotten the value of b to be equal to 10, that means we can simply find other parameters. Now, let's substitute the value of uh, b equal to 10 into the first expression, that is, into the derivative of equation 1, a equal to 21 divided by b. If we do that, we can get the value of our a. From that expression, we can see we are given that a is equal to 21 divided by b, right? So if b is equal to 10, then our a will be equal to 21 divided by 10, and this will be equal to 2.1. So the value of our a is equal to 2.1, and that is one of the solutions. The next one, let's substitute the value of b into y equal to 9 divided by b. We could substitute that into the value of 9, y equal to 9 divided by b. We substitute b equal to 10, we'll have our y to be equal to 9 divided by 10, and this will be equal to 0 0.9. So the value of our y will be equal to 0 0.9. And that is the value for what? For y. Now finally, we are going to find the value of a. We've gotten a, b. We're going to find the value of x. From that expression, we can find the value of x. Now let's use equation 3. From equation 3 or equation 2, we can find the value of x. x minus y is equal to 5. Let's take equation 2. From equation 2, from equation 2, we are given that x minus y is equal to 5. So the value of our x, which we have gotten, is equal to which we are looking for is minus y is 0 0.9 right and this will be equal to 5. Substituting this we are going to have the value of our x to be equal to 5 plus 0 0.9. If we sub add 0 0.9 to both sides the value of our x will be equal to 5.9 and that is the value of our x. We can simply also use another expression. We will still use another expression from those three four expressions we've gotten a plus x equal to 8. We're still going to have the value of 5.9 as our solution. So what are the values of a, b, x and y? The value of our a is equal to, we got it as 2.1. The value of our b 
is equal to 10. The value of our x is equal to 5.9. And the value of our y is equal to 0 0.9. These are the values of those parameters given to us that we are asked to find in that mathematics puzzle that is given to us up there. I know you did enjoy solving this math puzzle with me. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with friends and colleagues, and remember to subscribe to my channel for more simplified math content. Thanks so much for watching and bye-bye for now.